All right, another weekend of football is behind us. As always, let's pick some game balls. Rick, who's your first game ball going to go to? It's going to go to Bastrop quarterback Josiah Monroe. They couldn't say his name right in the press box, in the PA system at Westlake. But all he did was throw for 271 yards, three touchdowns. Big upset in, in my eyes. Bastrop, 24-21 over Westlake. He definitely deserves one. All right, my first game ball is going to go to Dylan Cox, um, Cedar Park wide receiver. He was an all-district pick last year. Up to this weekend, hadn't had a touchdown catch this year. In fact, the Cedar Park, entire Cedar Park team hadn't had a touchdown catch, but he hauled in three um, passes from North Nathan Thornhill. Um, Cedar Park won a shootout with Round Rock 55 to 45. And watch out for that Cedar Park offense. Um, we talked all about their defense, and their offense was pretty anemic for the first part of the season. But the last three games, they scored at least 40 points in each of those games. So maybe that offense is coming around, and that showdown at Stony Point in a couple weeks could be, could be kind of fun to watch. Um, second game ball. Uh, Brennan Blakemore. And all he did was he, he had two touchdowns, one from 82 yards, fumble return, 88 yards, interception return, and he caught a touchdown pass. Watch out, Wimberley is, is really coming back strong, especially on the defensive end. Okay, my second game ball is going to kind of go out, out on a serious note. We're going to go out to Lowing. Um, as a lot of us know, their um, head coach passed away kind of unexpectedly last Thursday, and on Friday they still decided to play. and. Um, one, they went in the game with one win over the past two years, but they did come out with a win over San Antonio Houston, 26-13. And star player was Braxton Allen. He's a junior quarterback, um, threw for a touchdown run for two more. So sometimes you just got to go out and play the game, and that's what those kids did, and they came out with a story, storybook ending. So um, congrats to them, um, and we'll see how um, they play going forward to the um, rest of the season. So that was pretty neat up there. So and They're going to they're gonna have a memorial service for – Coach Robert Dean uh, this Wednesday night at the high school. So obviously it's a big shock to their community, but it was good to see them get that big win. Okay, so we'll um, see if they can keep winning games and check back with us next week. And as usual, we'll have some more game balls for you.